Well, hello there, my fellow miners and crafters. This is Good Times with Jeffy here with his car hat on. Hello. Welcome to this new episode here on the Hermit Quest map. We are still building here. Um, you haven't seen a video from me in so long on here. And I, I thought it was time to do something again. Um, there's been some stuff that happened, but yeah, some of the stuff is fixed now. Finally, remember last episode I did show you a couple of those things. Um, there were random diamond door and magma blocks over here and over there and everywhere there were some some weird blocks. And it looks like something is right over here. That is exactly right. Oh no, it is actually. Someone just opened it. Well, I have been working a little bit uh, since the last couple of days again. And I have found a little bit more inspiration to finish up this, this project again. And as we see in here, there is some more stuff in here now. Yes, I finished these houses. Uh, well, with finished I mean almost finished, because there are a couple of ones that need some stuff below here. And if we go up here, there is some stuff here. It is not too much. It's not too full. There are some uh, loot crates around the place. And you can cook some stuff over here. And then there's a rug, which I quite like. I have them in all of the houses. And there are some chairs here. And if we go upstairs, there is a bed. This one was already here. This one I've already showed off, I think, some time before. And up here is just some storage area with some crates that you can pick up in this house so let's go into the next house take a look there and see what is going on there so in this next house there is a little bit of a different setup it's all quite similar um, with the furnaces and some of these loot crates and then somewhere you can sit uh, and upstairs is similar there is a bed this is quite a little bit different uh, there are some shelves and everything you need is here right I guess so this is one that is also finished down the bottom kind of but I might change this around a bit because I like this one better with like the, the wall here and just a small amount of stuff around the place this one has so much boxes it feels feels not normal so I, I want to change that a bit up and this one needs to be done and this one needs to be done and the same goes for the other side um, I just copied these over to the other side so they have the same stuff in there uh, this one seems to not be fully done yet there again there are some weird things in there this one that one is right all right let's go into this one and take care of those blocks straight away I know I finished this one yes I did but I did not look upstairs so these can go hopefully we won't crash we do not because that has happened before uh, we have crashed because of those weird blocks because those blocks were never there really well they were but there were other blocks and after that one crash where all of that, like all of the custom NPC stuff was weird. I kind of lost my focus on building on here. And now uh, I finally have everything or most things fixed. And that is what made me come back and want to finish this really. So the only things we have to finish actually are those houses and then the room over here that is the only thing in this kingdom that we really need to do still so what I thought is I am going to work on this room right here and I'm going to do some little update thingies um, to show you what I have been doing in this room because this is kind of like a, a throne room I guess that's what it's gonna be uh, so we're gonna have like a big throne maybe even with um, a, a king statue on there or something like that 
just like a giant throne uh, maybe with a smaller throne where someone can sit in, in, in like in front because like there's there's this big king statue where which you're which you're sitting on and which is kind of cool i guess and then other than that we might add some other things around the like the place there needs to be some more stuff added i might make the room a little bit smaller but we'll see we'll see what we'll we'll do with it um, i'm not too sure if i want to keep doing that ceiling i guess i do because we have that everywhere uh, and it's quite a cool ceiling still i quite like it but we'll we'll have to see maybe yeah we'll we'll have to see I'll, i will see what i'm gonna do with this maybe i'm gonna play around with another kind of ceiling and maybe i will even change the ceiling uh there's one thing i don't really like about it anymore and that is this yellow <laughs> for some reason it looked good to me the first time but now i don't know uh, and the prismarine kind of stands out a little bit too much maybe so we're gonna see what we're gonna do about that maybe we are not gonna change it maybe we are but for now i will see you back when i have done some more stuff all right guys we are back and I have been working on this place so much. As you see right now, if you don't know the base shape of this building, I have changed something. So, on top of this thing, there's a new big thing instead of the small little uh, area we had up top. There now is a bigger thing that we still need to do the side of, of course. Because we're probably not going to keep it like that. We are going to uh, work on that a little bit. But I decided to redo the insides. And this is already looking way more epic than it was. And there are a lot of mobs over here because this is not lit up yet. And there's an invisible spider. Neat. So this is already way bigger than it used to be. It looked so small it is so big now and we have some lava chandeliers and everything and some like like some big staircases upstairs and it is nowhere near done but I decided to do this instead of just make the throne room so now we have one big throne room and here's the throne and from the throne you can even see a little part of the like the, the market area down there um, I had a, a window here, but that did not look good, especially on the outside. So I decided to go with a banner, which I made for in this kingdom, basically. And I have two of them on those sides as well. And then we have this thing. I'm not really sure about it yet. Um, I'm going to probably play around with some other things, because now it's so default Minecrafty. And I might want to change that up a little bit. Um, I'm not too sure what to do with the rest of the back wall yet. And the, the roof itself needs some changing probably as well. I'm not too sure what to change that to. But on this side here, this side, we have our library. And you can just pick up a book and go and read it over here. And there's a nice candle. And I really like this. This is something that I um, decided to use just as a little bit of extra decoration. I really like it. Um, I started using them up here, which I really liked. The uh, the end rods and then up here. There are a lot of end rods in, <laughs> in this build. But I think it, it's, it looks good. It, it's not too much, basically. And we're lighting stuff up with end rods and fire mostly. And obviously some hidden lighting here and there. But end rods and fire is uh, is something we're using here a lot. Or fire, uh, lava, I mean. Because we are using lava in our kingdom anyways. Um, it kind of resembles um, molten iron in a way. That's how I started using it here anyways. But it fits. It kind of fits the theme of um, an armor kingdom. They smith their own armor, so they have to have heat sources and everything. 
and we started using it everywhere so it I quite like this I first made like glass chandeliers and I didn't really like it um, they didn't fit the theme so I decided to make them out of lava and you cannot go into here it's all uh, barriers so uh, yeah no worries there and then down on this side um, I'm thinking of a big dining area which we used to have upstairs but now I want to have one over here with all these mobs um, this will be lit up obviously uh, even though it would be nice to have like a lot of mobs in here but the mobs are for something else and you can still go to the end of it and walk all this way to go why is there light up there um, all right let's put some stuff up there now there isn't light up there nice you can still go through here and get out of the kingdom on this side and then I have been doing a little bit of stuff down there but it's not really um, anything big in particular um, I changed something up which I was playing with before uh, that is in this thing over here. We now have swords over here and I had like a, a sword rack over here and one of these things down here, but you could pick up these swords and now you cannot because there are barriers in front. And that is actually it that what I did over here. I was trying to do something with this to make it um, to give it a little animation. But I decided against it because um, it would be uh, quite weird um, going too far away, it didn't load properly and stuff. So that's why I decided against that. Um, but if you have any other ideas of what to do in this area instead of a dining area, then tell me in the comments below because we are not going to finish this area um, in this episode. Back here, I want to um, just put some random things around. And I want to make an area um, of uh, crates and stuff so you can get up here. And then I want you to be able to go over to this side um, and not do that. And then all the way over here, have one of them tier three crates. Let's actually put them in already like have one over there you if you're here you could see that um, so it could be worth it to go there and let's put a tier 2 crate there as well I might light up that whole area because having mobs there as well as being able to fall off is kind of not too good I mean you could go here and just try to hit the guy off <laughs> there he goes he's dead but uh, that that kind of defeats the purpose of it um, being able to go in there but if you think I should not light that up then I won't but for now this is what I have been doing I have been doing a ton here and I will be doing more in another episode of course we are going to finish this kingdom together I hope to see you in the next one. This one may have been a little bit too short, but yeah, I have done a lot off camera. As you see here, it is a bunch of stuff that I did. Um, but I will see you in the next one. Hopefully we can do some cool stuff because I want to do some extra cool stuff soon as well. I'm not too sure what yet, so I need to think about that. But I want to do some cool stuff, hopefully. So I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to check out these two videos as well. And if you want to see more videos, please subscribe and click the bell next to the subscribe button. I hope to see you next time.